Nnamdi Kano's continued detention. Economic activities granted in Enugu as residents observed Monday sit at home amid fuel naira scarcity. The exercise was initially ordered by the indigenous people of Biafra and IPOP as a form of protest against the continued detention of its leader, Namdi Kano. Hi everyone, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. Residents of Enugu State have continued to observe the infamous Monday sit at home exercise. The exercise was initially ordered by the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, as a form of protest against the continued detention of its leader, Namdi Kano. But after IPOP reversed the, direct, the directive, some armed persons, now known as the unknown gunmen, started enforcing the sit at home exercise by attacking people found outside. Sahara reporters had has reported how on Mondays the sit at home exercise penalized economic and social activities in Enugu, the capital of old eastern Nigeria, and capital of the defunct Biafran, which the separatists are fighting for its actualization. It was again observed on Monday by our correspondent that market, Ogbeti New Market, Akpata Market, Old Artisan Market, and Camp Spare Parts Market continue to witness skeleton service. With the scarcity of new Naira notes and Premium Moto Spirits, PMS, otherwise known as patrol, our correspondent observed that most roads and streets were deserted. Many residents only go out on Mondays when there is an emergency or it is un unavoidable. Boasting on his Twitter handle, the self-proclaimed disciple of Namdi Kano, the leader of autopilot, IPOP, Simeon Ekba, liked the Monday 6 at home protest against the continued detention of Namdi Kano in the custody of the Department of State Service, DSS, as a replica of what would happen on February 25th, the day for presidential election, along with a video of empty Ogbete market. Ekma wrote, sit at home in Biafra, 13th of February 2023, this is Enugu province demonstrating they are ready to end the agreement of slavery between Biafra and Nigeria. From 23rd, 2nd of 20, uh, 2nd February 2023, this is how Biafra land we like. No Nigerian election. Biafra is a tax that must be done, he said. Meanwhile, Nigerians have reacted. February 25th, the day of presidential election, these idiots will deny Obi the vote of his Southeast people. Why the Yorubaras will vote for Jagaban? It will be self defeating for the Igbos, for they do not know what they want. They should endeavor not to blame other tribes when Obi lost. Hmm. May Baba Blues destroy you and your entire generation for uttering these abominable words. Come and govern your rotten, your rotten present, president in Biafra land when we never and did not vote for any politician in the entire Biafra land. These are reactions by Nigerians. You are so stupid not to realize that some Igbos have relocated to the southwest and we never have anything to do with the evil enclave. If Lagos is doing well, some of us will be making more money and we care less if you choose to kill 
anyone on the street of Alibo. It shall not be well with you and your entire family. Reactions are getting tough. And your generation for trying to validate genocide and terrorism in Igbo land. Biafra is leaving this evil contraction in, in the next 20 days. We can't allow any evil election in Biafra land. Even gain, if you dare us come out that day and test our our res, re, resolute Margaret. Hmm. This one tough one. Good for themselves. Igbos are now fugitive in every state in Nigeria. Hunger wear too much for tan. Nahim people see they believe in sita tone policy. There is more to this. Who are the people enforcing this sita tone in, in this crucial time? Voting is a must, and one thing remembering his is still held captive by Nigerian government in detention is another. Wow, very good decision for them. Let them continue like this. I am just thinking of court sentence, this guy to life imprisonment. Those doing this sit at home every Monday, I think they will change it to sit at home every day. The reason why Zone called Nigeria is still keeping this man in detention is what I don't know. Free this man and let him go. I wish they will continue to observe it till eternity. That is good for them. Let them continue. I am right here in Enugu. Nobody is observing it too. And we are not going to observe it. Lie, lie for lie. Okay, guys. These are some reactions by Nigerians. What's your take concerning this? Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section, please.